Excuse me. <laughs> He's seeping, baby. Let him see. Do you like riding forward? Bubby must like his big boy seat and fell asleep. Ooh, I like it. Can you see everything? Did you see the trees and the sky? Mama. What? Trees. trees, yeah. You Mama. like to see it? Mama. Trees. Sky. What else do you see, Bubby? Clouds in the sky. Love you. Sun in the sky. Sun in the sky. You are my sun in the sky, Bubby. Love you, babies. trap and Arby's because my appetite is finally back after not being able to eat for like three months and I feel so much better and I just want to eat everything. So yeah, we went and got some meat and then we went and seen Dada and checked on progress on the new house. I wish I was there so bad, but it's just, it's not safe for two babies and it's more of a headache to try and stop them from killing themselves for me to help. It's just easier for him to do it by himself at this point if I don't have a babysitter and yeah the boys are too tired it's July 5th they are too tired from the festivities this last weekend they were too tired this weekend I think they have some kind of little stomach bug or something that they've been eating is not agreeing with them I think it could be the Cogurt from Costco but who knows Anyways, we're going to go home. Raylan's asking to go home and watch Ice Age. You don't have to go potty, do you? Because I'll pull over right here, Bubby. We have had a good day. I'm going to go home and clean, I guess, while the boys relax. It is 6 o'clock, so I don't want them to fall asleep. And if they do fall asleep, they need to do it, like, now. <clears throat> but, yeah. I hope you guys have a good day. I'll check back in in a little bit. What's up, guys? So I have been slacking off the vlogs for like two weeks. Today's the 20th, July, July 20th. Um, I wasn't going to bore you guys with the details, but first I ripped a fingernail off. I know this looks nice and pretty, but it's not underneath. There's like barely anything that, that's a, that acrylic is holding on to. And I was just out of commission. I couldn't do anything around my house. My house turned into a disaster. I It was just hard for me to do anything. I was snagging it on everything. And if you've done that, you know how excruciatingly <laughs> painful it is. So, yeah, that happened. And then the boys got sick while I was still hurt. And then I'm a couple days behind the boys with this virus. And it has just been kicking my ass. Um, the boys are obviously starting to feel better. They're on like day six and they're climbing everywhere and trying to drive me nuts. He's coming, Rye's coming up here too. But yeah, I just want to get back into vlogging even if I'm still sick and try to come live here. I got us all showered and dressed. Well, my nudist here is halfway dressed. Everybody tell Raylan that he needs to start wearing pants. Big boys wear pants. I'm so proud of him. He's potty trained. I haven't cleaned poop off his boy's butt in months. He doesn't have accidents until we put something on his butt. And we can't be naked forever, Bubby. Mommy likes to be naked too, but we can't. We can't live life like that. It makes people uncomfortable. <laughs> Cutest thing ever, you guys. My kids. Are <laughs> Bubby, what are you doing? Are you being bad? Huh? Oh, you want another cinnamon roll? Those are yummy, huh? That was yummy, huh? Yummy cinnamon roll. So yeah, I need to figure out the quality and the audio for these vlogs. But I'm just going to keep rolling with my old iPhone footage because I'm having fun making and editing these and I think I'll really love looking back at them. 
So I hope you guys are like kind of enjoying them and, and look forward to them and want to subscribe and stick around and support. Quit, Bubby. I'm talking. I can stand the craziness, chaotic of my life. But yeah, I, like I always say on here, I'm getting ready to run through the house. Because I think that's all I do. I'm getting ready to run through the house, but there's like a couple little uh, redecorating things that I want to do. So I'll show you guys that because I show you guys enough of me picking up the house. But I mean, if you guys are into those time lapses of me picking up toys, I can do that. But yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Hey guys, so it's been a few days and I still haven't got to that little redecorating project, which is like right here. I had these pretty um, feathers covering up these paint, <laughs> these paint chips, and I wanted to switch it to these flowers for summer. That was my spring. This is my summer. Maybe I'll get to it before fall. <laughs> but honestly, I just had them from the Dollar Tree, and I've had them forever, so I just want to use them. And these paint chips drive me nuts. And I was trying to wait for the boys to take a double nap for me so I could do this without them immediately ripping the stickers right back off and i haven't got that in a few days i have not got them to nap together in quite a few days this cold just threw us all off schedule to be honest and my life feels like it's in shambles without my three hour break every day so hopefully that's not over hopefully that phase of my life is not over because I'm not ready to give that up. It's been so nice. But yeah. I'm just going to try do, to do this with them awake. So we'll see how that goes. And then I'll um, kind of show you like the little toy rotation. Or I should say elimination. That I did the last few days. I've just been cleaning and trying to get on the mend. Me and the boys trying to get us better. But yeah, let's throw this into time lapse and I'll show you what I'm doing here. Here it is guys. I know it's not symmetric, but I did the best I could with the flowers I had and the paint chips. Like I said, I don't love the stickers up there with the baskets, but I had them. I wanted to use them. It's fun. It's cool. The boys like it. Do you like the flowers, Bubby? Are they pretty? Pretty. Raylan said, cheese. Are my flowers pretty? Yeah, cheese. How do you like them? You gonna leave them alone? Okay, so here's the deal with the cat house. I am storing all the toys that I want out of reach of the boys up here. Uh, these were all over the living room and I just got completely sick of picking them up every day. So they, they were all over this living room, just baskets of little toys. And the boys wouldn't even play with them. They would just go through and dump them out and make a great huge mess for me and I'm done with it. So we're putting them up there and I only left big things out on the ground and the tables. These three baskets are up here but they don't dump those ones out. And I'll show you what I left out for them. But yeah, mama, mama was done. <laughs> so this is what we got up here. This is like their um, Toy Story toys, Woody and Buzz, Bullseye, all them. These are these blocks, all of their Hot Wheels, cars. This is some Amazon toys my girlfriend got for them, but they're really little, but I, they love them. I'll show you guys that. Um, stuff for the girls, doctor stuff, dentist stuff, and little girl stuff. And then these are all little characters. So yeah, 
And then these have been up here hidden. The color, the color fruit sorting, and then hard toys that are like weapons. <laughs> so yeah, this is what I got going on here. It looks okay. It looks decent and it's already saved me such a headache in the couple days that I threw those up there. The living room time has been cut dramatically. So these are some of the only baskets I left out for them. This is their little music basket. I love when they play with these guitars. It's about the cutest thing ever. And the drums, all their drums. This is stuffed animals. None of the kids ever really mess with this. Like the girls might pretend one of them's a baby, but other than that, it doesn't really get messed with. And then all the kids know if they dump the blocks out, they're picking them up. So <laughs> they still play with them, but they will pick the blocks up. They still have the two baskets on the side tables, but this literally has 10 cars. Well, nine, we're missing one. We've been missing it. It's driving me absolutely nuts. <laughs> And then I took all the little stuff out of this basket. It's literally like 10 big things that Rye and Raylan still play with. And I have them for when the little babies come over. time they wanted to play in the pool in like two weeks i am so excited they're definitely feeling better it's eight o'clock so if i can keep them up about two more hours we could potentially get back on schedule don't drink that water bubby right don't drink Dragonflies. Oh, I'm gonna miss this house so much. The wildlife. It's amazing. Do you guys see these dragonflies? Wow, they're huge. I want you guys to just enjoy this peaceful moment with me and watch these gorgeous, huge dragonflies fly around and listen to my kids play. God is so good. You guys, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> 